Hey guys, it's Ashley, and this is going to be Kai's four-month update. <sighs> Can't believe it that she is four months. I feel like I say this every single video, but I truly cannot believe it. Like, where has the time gone? It is so crazy to see her, like, learn and develop and just go from something that was just an itty-bitty little baby that was just <sighs> so tiny and sweet to, like, a person. Like, she has such a personality now, it's crazy. It's I, everyone's like, oh, the time goes by so quick, blah, 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 all that crap. But then it's like, oh my god, it really does. Like, it's crazy. I can't believe it. Um, so let me get into my lovely iPhone so that I can find my notes that I took on this. Not a lot because I tend to forget to do things because I'm a procrastinator and I'm like, I'll remember. Never ever do. So note to everyone out there that likes to procrastinate. My hair looks so stupid. Oh my goodness. I don't know what is going on anyways off topic now so like I said my sweetest little cupcakey princess is four months as of today ah, I'm a four month old and two months out of six month old and on and on and on like most people um <laughs> but she wears size two diapers as of right now um I think she's close to being in a three though I think she is because they're just fitting her a little weird maybe it's the brand I'm using but I don't know I might get I did try a three once on her um, and it was a little big, but it didn't look bad on her. So we might be upgrading to a three soon. Um, she's still in her three month clothing and it's so cute. It's still a little big on her, but it's kind of starting to fit and she's like filling out and I'm like, Oh my God, my chunky chunk. Um, she can roll over and it is still amazing. She, she doesn't know how to stay still now. She went from just being a little sleepy, butt that doesn't do anything to a baby that won't stop moving now. She's kind of cute and she's just so determined to do everything. It is so adorable. She is the most determined baby I have ever seen. If she wants something or wants to do something, she's going to do it. Which is a little frightening for me because I'm like, man, what if she wants to walk? She's going to do it. <laughs> so, or crawl and all that stuff. So I'm like, oh God, my child is going to do whatever she pleases. Which means she's just like me, which is still frightening. <laughs> um, She laughs and she has the cutest laugh. Okay, all babies have cute laughs because they're children and they're tiny and they're just the sweetest little thing and they laugh so cute and makes you laugh. But I swear, her laugh is the cutest laugh I've ever heard in my whole entire 20 years of existence. Like, I adore her laugh. It makes me laugh so, so hard. Um, It's so cute. I actually had a video, or I have a few videos of her laughing, but the lighting is all ugly on them. So... Yeah, I don't think I'll show you guys those. Maybe I'll get a better one where I'll show you where she's laughing and it's adorable. Um, she only wakes up about once or twice at night depending when she falls asleep, which is super awesome. I cannot wait for her to sleep all throughout the night, uh, which I feel is coming soon because she really just wakes up real close to the morning time. Like She'll wake up at like 4 or 5 and then again at 7. So kind of all night if you think about it. I don't know. I'll call it all night. She's super talkative. Like she... she talks all the time like the little baby talk and screams and stuff like that which I think is so adorable she just goes crazy like if you talk to her if you're like hi Kai hi and just kind of have a conversation with her not that stupid baby talk that people do I don't get that but like really talk to her she'll like sit there and scream and coo and make noises and kick her legs and her arms it's so cute it's like she's having a conversation with you I love it I'm like what really that's crazy like talking back to her <laughs> she just keeps going with it um, she's super, super observant. I haven't seen a baby her age that observant before, but then again, it could just be me being biased, but I don't think I've seen a baby that observant at her age. I get, I hear that a lot from people too, like, she's only four months, she's that observant and talkative and da 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 So, yeah, anything, like, she adores sparkly stuff, which I'm like, mm, most girls. Um, yeah, she adores sparkly stuff, shiny stuff, anything colorful that moves, just anything that can get her attention. Like, she follows people. If she likes their voice or if it's really deep or kind of loud, she'll follow their voice and follow them throughout the whole room until she can't see them anymore. Like, she'll try to turn her body to see them and all types of stuff. It's, it's ridiculous. Like, if she hears me, she'll try to get in any position to where she can see me and watch me. It, it's so cute. I love it. It's like, Mommy's here! <laughs> and she goes crazy and tries to find me. Um, I'm going to have to get a phone. Um, she tries to sit up on her own, which I think is really funny because she just kind of topples forward, but she can kind of sit up on her own, like, um, for a few seconds and then she'll like lean back against you again, or she'll put her hands down and she'll go like, this is her body and this is her butt and she'll go real far and then kind of stay there and then shoot back real quick. So it's kind of cute. She tries so hard to sit up on her own and she can kind of sort of do it. Not really though, only for a little bit, like a few seconds and then she's back to leaning up against you, but at least she tries. Um. She can, when she's like doing tummy time, she scooches, um, which is really cute to me. And I'm like, where are you going? You can't go anywhere. But she scooches. Like she will turn herself completely around. She'll scooch away from me a little bit. Um, 
it's not like an actual crawl, it's just like she kicks her legs real fast and she'll pull the covers and she kind of just gets away or turns in circles, which is really cute because it's like she's trying her so hard to go somewhere, but she can't go anywhere. Um, but yeah, she still loves tummy time. It's like one of her favorites. She'll literally roll onto her stomach herself and just lay like that and play. It, it, she's weird. I don't know. She loves it. I think it's cute when she's on her tummy because that's when she's most talkative. So I'm okay with it. I'm like, go ahead. We'll play like this. I'll lay on my tummy too. Um, she can put her pacifier in her mouth. It is so cute. She has fully discovered her hands. She kind of, majority for the most part, know how they work. Like she knows how to hold things. Like if she wants it, she'll stick her hands out and grab it. Her depth perception is kind of off still. <laughs> it's okay. She's only four months, but she'll stick her hands out. She'll grab it and it instantly goes up to her mouth. Well, most things, not everything. Some things she's kind of like, what the hell is this? And she'll hold it for a while. But for the most part, she has like control of her hands. If she drops her pacifier and it's in reach and she can see it, she'll grab it and pick it up and kind of go like around her mouth like she'll go eh, 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 and then it goes in her mouth so it's so cute and she'll pull her pacifier out of her mouth she puts her little monkey in her mouth um she puts her hands in her mouth what else she has an obsession with cups right now i'm not sure what it is she just loves plastic cups like they calm her down why i don't know she was screaming her head off one day and her dad gave her a cup a little plastic like throwaway cup and she quieted down and put it up to her mouth like she was trying to drink and it was so cute i'm like what are you doing you've never used a cup in your life all you know is bottles and boob but yeah she loves it i have to show you guys pictures of that which i plan to do by the way i um was going to show kai in this video but she is sleeping currently so like most of you moms know when your baby is sleeping you do not wake that sleeping baby so i won't actually physically show her in this video but i'll show some cute pictures of her they aren't really gonna be ones fully of her they'll just be kind of like side views and just little cute stuff that she's doing so i'll include that at the end of this video um but yeah see now i've sidetracked myself um yeah she just loves 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 cups she loves her monkey she absolutely hates blankets i don't know what it is but every time i cover her up with any type of blanket first thing she does is kick it off if she sleeps she'll slowly kick her way out of it she just hates blankets so it's a little crazy i don't understand it because i love being covered up i get cold so easily um what else she hates socks too i don't know what it is about socks but she always tries to kick them off but if she's wearing shoes she's okay with them but other than that she absolutely hates socks um what else she's really cute <laughs> i should have shown you guys her i wish she was awake so you guys could see her because you would love it love it love it um see this is what happens when i don't write stuff down i get sidetracked and i forget and i forget a bunch of cool things about her uh, that you guys should know i haven't got a chance to weigh her so i'm not sure how much she weighs so yeah probably like 12 well she, okay last time i think she was like 12 pounds so she's probably close to 13 maybe 14 pounds a little chunk but um she doesn't have that much hair yet still it's trying to get long it's really cute i can finally clip something in it but it's so thin that it looks kind of stupid so she wears bows and it's winter time so i'm buying her a bunch of beanies and cute little hats for her to wear finally um what else she loves to pull on things. Her first reaction when she sees stuff is to grab it, which is so cute, but it also sucks because if you put her on your shoulder, first thing she's grabbing, your collar, corner of your shirt, your hair, your earrings, or your necklace. Sucks. It is terrible. I kind of hate it, but got to deal with it. Um, we still haven't gotten her ears pierced. I'm a big scaredy cat, so I haven't done it yet, <laughs> um, but I do plan to do it soon. She does have a doctor's appointment for her four-month checkup coming up, and she has to get shots. And once again, I'm a big scaredy cat for her to do that. Her too much shots, I almost cried, and I am not a crier. Um, her dad will be at work, so he can't come with me. So I'm making my dad come with me so he can hold her and I can sit in the corner like a little baby. Um, God, this is what happens when you procrastinate. Don't procrastinate, people. Learn from my mistakes. <laughs> um, I'll say that's it for now because I can't think of anything else. If I do, I'll put it in the description box. And keep watching so you can see some cute pictures of Kai. And I will see you guys in my next update. Bye.